Today we're going to talk about bullets. We're going to apply bullets in three different ways because Microsoft Word allows you to apply three different types of bullets. There are bullets, numbering, and then there is a multi-level list. We're going to start with the bullets. In order to apply bullets to a list that already exists, we would want to select all of the content for the bullets and then click on bullets. You can also choose which type of bullet you want to use. To turn the bullets off, we would just simply deselect bullets for that content. Again, to apply it, we would just click bullets to turn it on. To turn it off, we would just click bullets again. In order to change the picture, we can use the drop down list to select what type of bullet we want. Now, in creating a numbered list, there's another way to apply bullets, and that is to uh, apply the bullet to the line that you're on first, and then just simply start typing what you want to type in your list. And there you see where the bulleted list is already created as I type out my list. The third type of bulleted list is a multi-level list. And here we're going to apply a multi-level list. I'm going to select the content that I want to apply the multi-level list. I'm going to choose which type of multi-level list I want to use. And what you see is that this particular list is put in project format. So therefore it shifted it to the next page because of the spacing. Now what I'm going to do is start applying the different levels to the list. So I'm going to use a combination of the indent increase and my tab button to change the levels of the bullet. This would be the second level. This would be the third level. This would be the third level. First level, second level, third level. And this would be a third level. Now, for projects, I'm going to use the tab button. Okay, switch back over to the first page because now the spacing has changed and I am merely just adding tabs to the list and now I am in project 3 and I will do a combination of both the tab and the indent increase So here we have it, first level, second level, third level. If I want to change the levels of anything in the third level or the second level at any time, I can decrease the indent or I can hit shift tab. We can also change the bullet to list format. So I can select the content again, and then I can go to change the format type. We can also click on the bullets in each type to change the indent position. So you will select the bullets you want to change, do a shortcut click by using the right button on your mouse, and then going to adjust list indent and then you can change the indent spacing and what it does is change the level of the indent in your list and this is how you create a 
bullet, number bullet, and a multi-level bulleted list in Microsoft Word. 